Hello everyone and welcome back to the ep to another episode of Ark the Lad, Twilight of the Spirits. I'm Ultra Gamer J and and as a and it is the dawn of the second video, one more remaining after this one. So oh yeah. And in case you have any info or helpful tips for this game because it's been a while since I've played this. Uh, don't hesitate to leave them in the comments section or anything because we're all together on this ride. So, with that out of the, my out of my system, let's get down. Let's get this cutscene out of the way. A divine ruler with an evil heart appeared, and he used the power of science to try to rule the world. However, many brave people stood up against this ruler. Following the power of the spirits, they defeated the evil ruler, and they sealed his body inside an ark. Do you know what an ark is? It's like a box that holds mysterious power. So the bad guys always lose, right? Well, the Divine Ruler came back to life thousands of years later to take his revenge for being in prison for so long. Really? Then what happened? Coming back to life and escaping from the Ark, the Divine Ruler had taken a very strange form, one never seen before on this Earth. And then he tried to destroy the world. However, there appeared a great hero and a holy mother who carried on the will of all those brave souls of the past. And they stood up to fight this evil divine ruler. It was a long and fierce battle, but in the end, they defeated the divine ruler and sealed him in the ark once more. However, as a result of all this, the world was badly scarred, and the spirits disappeared from the face of the earth. But something else appeared in their place. Beings called Deimos. Humans and Deimos loathed each other, and this led to fierce confrontation. In time, the world was divided in two, with humans living in one half, and Deimos in the other. And eventually, it became strictly forbidden for humans and Deimos to associate with one another.
bad guys always lose. Um, Karg, Junji Ito would like a word with you. As for humans and Deimos, most being being mortal enemies, I'm sure that in in no shape or form there will come an event in this game where the two where the two sides have to join forces. I mean, <laughs> that's just plain silly. I mean, come on. When has that ever worked in the world of fiction? Nope, there is no way that's ever going to happen. Nah, no way in hell. Dream on. Come on, look. Let, let me just sync up with Paulette here. Yeah, spirits are just make-believe, like the Loch Ness Monster, or, um, let's see here, or, uh, or Bigfoot, who I was, who I was going to take a picture of after I tried to born my girlfriend, but then she was like, there is no way. Come on, let me talk to this NPC. It's time for us to explore the town because raisins, and we, and also because we have to familiarize ourselves with this very nice piece of art, by which I mean the city landscape. Okay, let's try and go inside this building now. You don't say. Especially with that 200 it, uh, money you gave us, which is, I'm going to assume, chump change. Yeah, 
yeah, fun fact, the money or currency in this game is referred to as gods. Oh boy, that raises a few flags. Or it probably would in this day and age, I don't know. It probably would. Come on, let me talk to the NPC. Yeah, we're not going to need any of any items because we haven't even gone through the tutorial fight. Ah, come on, yep. Come on, yep. Frickin'. Sure, why not? Yeah, you are not looking at a graph, good sir. I have seen graphs, and that is no graph. That is a list at best. Also, apparently in this world, sticking my sword or a knife in gunpowder, like coating it maybe or something, something, it makes it a sword, a flaming sword of fire. what I wanted. I wanted to talk to that clerk to just to see what they were capable of saying. No, because we don't have the money. Okay, let's see. Wait, um, whose mother is she? Is she the guy's or the girl's? Because the soldier doesn't really make it clear. He says, my my wife and mother. That, as someone who excelled in English class, 
I don't know how to feel about that. Anyways, we're gonna uh, talk to this nice old lady in the next video and show you why this game has a bit of a special place in my heart. Heart. Yeah, so um, this is Ultra Gamer J. Hey, signing off. Remember to like and subscribe for more videos, and I hope to see you all again next time.